Hi everybody, Adessa here with formula.com. In this video, I'm going to show you how to integrate Infusionsoft CRM, also known as Customer Relationship Management, with your Formula Live Chat. This integration gives website owners the ability to add live chat to their website and incorporate new leads and contacts within Infusionsoft in a streamlined fashion. No need to manually add leads collected from live chat to your CRM. And to begin, we'll want to log into our formula dashboard. As you can see, I've already logged into mine and we'll want to click on this button here that is labeled My Apps. So once we're here on the screen, we'll want to click on Add App under Infusionsoft CRM Integration. And if you have an account with Infusionsoft already, you can go ahead and log in. Uh, if you do not, you'll want to create uh, an account in which you can do so right here. Since I already have an account, I'll go ahead and log into mine. And then you'll see a screen pop up asking for permission to integrate Infusionsoft and Formula. So you'll want to click on Allow. Now when we go back to the screen, we'll see that it no longer says Add App here, but Remove App, which means that we've successfully added the app. And now that we've added it, let's go to the exciting part of how this all works. So the first thing that we're going to want to do is send a test chat to ourselves and view it from the formula dashboard. So I'm going to do just that. I'm going to go to a test website that I have uh, formula installed on. And I've required that the email and name be entered in before a conversation could begin. So I'm going to go ahead and put in an email and my name and initiate a conversation. So now I'll go back to the dashboard and I'll see my message here and the pre-chat field requirements that I had, which was both the email address and my first name are on the right side of the screen right here. Now, something to keep in mind here is the information that you request visitors to enter before they begin a chat helps to create a contact for the visitor in Infusionsoft. And at minimum, a email address is required in order for Formula to create the contact in your Infusionsoft CRM and produce a CRM link on the dashboard that points to the new contact. So as you can see, I have the CRM link here that is now associated or affiliated with the contact information. Now an alternative way to collect the customer information is to manually enter it during a chat. And instances where this route would probably be the best way to go is if you're initiating a chat with a customer uh, or if you don't require pre-chat fields uh, for customers to enter in their information before they start a chat. So I've gone ahead and created an example of that here. Uh, where I haven't required any of the pre-chat fields, just a message to be sent. So I'll start with hello. And we'll go back to the dashboard here. And we'll see the message here, but as you'll notice on the right side here, there's no information regarding the visitor's contact. So what I want to do is go to edit here and input any of the information that I receive from the visitor. So a required field here is the email address. So I'll just put adessa at formula.com, adessa test click save here. And now you'll see all of that information on the right side here. And now we have a CRM link that is associated with the account. So if we click on this link, it'll open up a new tab and we'll see all of that information right here, the first name, the last name, the phone number, and the email address. And you can put in any of the information that you receive from the visitor here. And if you scroll down under notes, you'll see all of the chat transcripts that you have right here. Something to keep in mind is that it could take up to a minute after the chat ends for the chat transcript to appear. And there you have it. Anytime a visitor chats with you, Formula can automatically create a contact record inside of your Infusionsoft CRM. 
No need to manually create the contact yourself or manage contacts in two places. As always, feel free to contact us if you have any questions with regards to the information in this video at support at formula.com. Thanks so much.